Sigma 35mm uh, 1120mm F2.8 DI Mark III This one 70200 Canon New purchase Sigma 24 F1.8 Sony ZV-E10 Original kit lens Tamron 1120 Sony ZV-E10 Together with uh, Tamron 1120 Focusing Product showcase fast, right? Focusing very fast. Okay, M50 with small rig. Okay, using this Viltrox adapter. Camera is like gun, you know, sometimes sniper. Okay, 35 mm uh, crop sensor. See, this is my hobby. Even it's a M50, uh, it's a APSC, it's not a M50 version 2, Mark 2. This one is the first version, it's no problem. Focusing quite okay. Now let's just try. What loud? Damn near, yeah. So actually, lighting, purple color and also this blue color, uh, this tone, okay, it's RGB, RGB feel. Lighting very important for camera. Even though actually you use a phone also can be very clear. Especially if you're using this Sigma, actually camera, okay, okay. Lens, very important. Uh, now, See, this is an APS-C camera so usually I'm using for overhead with the Sigma 35mm now I'm gonna try this uh, full frame EOS R the most I like lah. okay together with this one Chun Chun Canon adapter because I'm not using the RF uh, series RF lens Using this EF mount, shotgun, hey sniper. Okay, now let's just try. Oh. So guys, twenty four mm Sigma uh, is a art art lens, art series. So if you use full frame, 24 is like actual 24, it's kind of wide. So if you use the 24 into the APS-C, it's something like, I think is, I'm not so sure about it. Maybe it's 35. So in case like example, if you use the 35 millimeter into this APS-C body, crop sensor, it will become like 50 millimeter. So in this videos, I will recommend you all, if you all are using the APS-C camera, feels like want to buy a 50mm for portrait shooting into the APS-C uh, body, I consider recommend you all think twice. Purchase a 35mm instead of 50mm because actually 35mm into APS-C camera as you can see just now is also very very near. For own self vlogging is definitely a no-no. As you can see if I'm using a 1120 like this one, this one is also a APS-C uh, crop sensor. 1120 you still can accept when you hold it like this, you still can see yourself. Okay, very very wide, still can accept. But for the full frame, if you all are recording same like me, I recommend 24. Oh god, another one is 20 millimeter. 20 millimeter wide angle lens into a full frame body actually is quite wide. It will stretch out your face and looks like 
very very unnatural uh, so this is the most natural uh, 24 so a lot of people like to use the zoom lens which is like a example 24 70 uh, like a l lens canon l lens which is very very expensive f2.8 or something like this this is more cheaper version this is a 70 200 zoom lens uh, this actually there's no is image stabilization it's a f4 uh, it's more cheaper so you all need to use tripod or if you all got learn about your hand stabilization maybe you can shoot it with a more higher shutter speed or in case if low light you all can remain the shutter speed around 100 150 and then just pump up the iso okay so now today in this videos you're all watching i'm recording with original sound from this canon and all this camera i'm not using my road microphone okay i didn't use this road microphone talking about zoom lens for zoom lens inside they got a lot of layer of lenses so i prefer if you all nicer clearer detail photo or videos fixed lens okay so it depends on you all guys camera gears is based on your own preference this video hopefully help you all a little bit that's it for this videos bye bye